Hey everyone, I'm Nate. And I'm Abby. We're the RC Sailors, and here is finally the $100 uh, RC ground vehicle, the truck that I promised you. We have a nice little monster truck here by ZD Racing. The last $100, $130 ZD Racing truck that we did on the channel was a uh, big success. So I'm very excited to share this with you. I'm very hopeful that it's awesome too. I love the look. I like the yellow. It's called the Raptors MT-16 Monster Truck 16th scale, I'm guessing? Yeah, it's a 16th scale brushless. Yeah. I like the sticker on it. I do too, yeah. <laughs> Gotta love the RC Sailor stickers. They look good on trucks, don't they? Mm -hmm. And uh, it's called the ZD Racing 9053. It comes in just barely over $100. Should be under $110, $115, right around that price point. So it's really good, a really competitive price. ZD Racing tends to generally have good quality at fair prices. Here we go. There's our brushless motor. Nice. Just tucked in down there, very nice. Have our steering servo there. It looks like we have our uh, receiver ESC combo in here. It doesn't look like, actually that is an individual unit. There's your ESC and the receivers in this waterproof case, which is pretty nice. On this side, we have our Dean's connector for the battery and here is where the battery is mounted. It comes with a 1500 milliamp 15C discharge rating, two cell 7.4 volt LiPo battery. The nice thing about that is it's hobby grade. You can charge this on your hobby grade charger. So we'll do our best to link one of our favorite chargers in the description box down below with this. I I'm pretty excited to drive this. This little guy just holds on right there with the battery. It even has little a little hoop there that you can run the battery wires so that they're not just dangling out in the open. Uh, let your balance lead get chewed up by the tires. Cool. That is a very nice little afterthought. Uh, and then we have a little on off switch dangling over here, which I think is okay, but you might want to do a little dab of hot glue somewhere to hold that in place. I'll probably add that later. It looks good. It really does. I, I like how that looks. It feels like pretty good quality. The, the tires are fairly soft, which means we should have good traction, good grip. I like that. We're at the I'm hill the, today. We are. I hope it can make it up that. It is a little truck. Yeah, it's 16th scale. I'll be very impressed. That might be yeah. like our first 16th scale to make it up if it does. If it does. We've also got the smaller side of the hill. The transmitter is the very nice ZD Racing. Uh, fairly universal transmitter. It seems like that monster truck that we had that was a 10th scale also used this transmitter. We have steering reverse, throttle reverse, steering trim, throttle trim, and uh, our dual rates there for steering as well. Some of these guys have different high low rates with a switch up here, but I don't believe this one does. So I don't think that switch functions, but I'll test it out. And uh, we just need, oh yeah, RC Sailor. Look at that. Four double A's down there for operation and as these cars drive by here. Uh, it does have an instruction manual, fairly nice. And the only downside about the charger is you'll need a converter, so keep that in mind. It even comes with a bind key. I feel like lately we've had so many vehicles that have non-proportional steering and throttle that I should show you. This does have very proportional steering and throttle, as, as it should at that price, but I just wanted to point that out. Uh, we don't know why we've seen so many vehicles without that, but there have been a lot. So wanted to point that out. Feels very good, very good. I like a monster truck more than any other style of vehicle because yeah, it can drive on the road. Yeah, it can do the gravel. This is very powerful. But you know, you don't really have to worry about getting hung up in grass or even tall grass. So monster trucks are generally my favorite style of ground vehicle. Now, I know this has a waterproof style receiver, but I do want to avoid this nasty mud because that looks like it's uh, probably collected some oil from cars and things. Just keep that in mind if you're driving there, Abby. Okay. This is quick. Feels like it has good control. Very nice. Very quick. Yeah. Nope. Well, that was a flip. But it's not... My turn. Hey, it's my turn. Gravel on me. I had to flip it for you. You're welcome. Okay, Abby's at the controls. Kind of was testing range a little bit, yeah. It's driving very well though. I mean, I want to point that out. It's uh, it's handling very nicely. That was my first flip, so. Wow, okay. Oh, oh you popped the wheelie. Nice, you uh, 
I don't know why I even touched the controls. Oh yeah. Oh, nice. Oh. I'll let you keep. I'll let you keep going. Let's see if you can actually pop a wheelie. This. This needs a wheelie bar. Are we trying the big hill? Go for it. Yeah. Oh. Too fast. Too fast. <laughs> You're asking for the transmitter back. Well, that was two wrecks for you. Uh-uh. I don't know what you're talking about. Well, it's all on video, so you could, you know, hit replay and watch that unless you edited that out. <laughs> Alright, can I do it? Can I do it? Oh! Oh! Oh no! Can you I go in the first? can't do it. <laughs> can I do this? I need momentum. I don't think it can do it from a standstill. Let's try one more time. I'm usually not the hill climb pro. I'm the root destroyer. If you remember that. I do. You still okay, haven't fixed that truck. I, oh, oh yeah. It did yeah. it. 16 scale. Wow. Conquered Look at that. Look at that monster hill. up there. That is wow. that is the hill my master. Turn. Oh my gosh. I get to drive it down. Uh -huh. Whoa. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I want to try it. Look at that. Hill. This thing is a beast. Oh, that is awesome. That's got some power now. That is. Watch it take off. Very impressive. Yeah. No, I know. I know. Very impressive. Okay. Good job, ZD Racing. Very. Oh. Okay. So you ramped, and I think it flew up about another <laughs> foot or so, just from uh, just from its momentum. So, <laughs> when all else fails, just hit it like a brick wall, Abby. Go. <laughs> And you really are, aren't you? It's fun. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. oh my gosh. Abby, I don't want to even say this, but uh, you consider Dromeda no. versus this. This is way better. Ooh, this has got some power packed in there. I the like that the stuff. wheels are like wider set. They are. We're rolling it because we're hitting stuff it just, pretty fast. It's just oh. fun. <laughs> But uh, see if you can actually get it to climb up the hill yeah. before you destroy this poor little guy. Has very limited power in reverse, yeah, doesn't it? Do that. That's okay though. Oh. Line it up. Abby, I'll meet you at the top. Here we go. I struggle more than the trucks climbing the. Uh, okay. I'm out of. I think there's a wasp. Uh, okay. Okay. I did it, and only for the cost of a Big Mac for fuel. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay, you got this. I think if you go at like half throttle, it's perfect. You can do it. It's possible. It can be done. User error. Oh, you hit the root. You hit the root. It's still on four wheels. Look at her go. Oh. Yeah. It's all a matter of the path that you choose. No power in reverse. That's what she said. Come on, Abby. We're rooting for you. Literally and figuratively. Okay. Oh, ouch. Oh, that was my toe. But you still did it. You still did it. You're there in, in some kind of vine that I'm pretty sure isn't poison ivy or anything. Okay. You did it. You did it. Yeah. Okay. Let's come down here to this side now. I just wanted some shade. So, okay. Good to go. <laughs> oh my gosh. Wow, that was epic. Sorry I wasn't zoomed in a little more on that. That was, that was cool. Okay, Abby, let's see what you got. Nice. Oh, wow. Wow. Oh, that is just awesome. Yeah, that's a cool little buggy. For, or truck, I should say. Like a $100, $110, I'm very impressed. That's awesome. You, you are just, you look like a professional monster truck driver. Oh, my turn, my turn, my, 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 my turn, my, my, my turn. <laughs> Someone better get that reference. You better. 
Go, go, go. Woo! This thing is tearing it up. I like it. Oh, nice. Ah! So sorry. <laughs> oh, he's short lived. That is the kind I like this. Thank you for Nathan, hit that root right there. Which one? That one. Because it did like a crazy flip the last time I hit it. Nice. <laughs> nice. Woo! Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Can't believe the battery is still going this strong. I kind of cheated. It's your turn. Yeah. <laughs> It's fine. Okay, guys, please uh, please forgive us. It's very hot out and we're just struggling a little. I don't want Abby to get too much sun. Got the little one on the way. But this thing is a blast. She's, she doesn't even want to wrap up, wrap up the video with me because she's just having fun driving that. <laughs> it is awesome. It's very awesome. I think the people on our channel that like the 12428 and in that style of vehicle, you need to pick one of these up because it's a good variety. This is the best 16th scale, like under 10th scale vehicle I think we've ever had. I, I like this a lot. It's, it's, uh, it's very... It, it's like, sorry for interrupting, no, it, like, it interrupt. can't land upside down almost. With oh, me especially, like, it's it just awesome. kept recovering. It was awesome. Maybe it's, I'm just that good. It is a, good. It's a very good basher. You know, the 12428 is kind of like a good trailing crawler slash basher. This has a little more top speed, a little more torque. It can ramp a little better. Uh, I'm just impressed with it. It's very fun. Very good 16th scale vehicle. Where you at, Abby? Somewhere back there. Oh, there it is. Nice. <laughs> I think you should definitely get this. I highly recommend it. We'll have it linked in the description box below. Be sure to check it out. Prices fluctuate, but I think you'll find it for under $115 or so. Very cool. Very cool. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.